right, I'm already seeing some that I have not seen anywhere else. A bunch. Alright guys, I am still in Canton here. I was on my way home actually. I don't even remember what I came down this way for. Oh, because I wanted to see the old uh, Kmart here. And then I came down here to turn around and I noticed another Dollar Tree. So I'm going to head in there. I need some things for the RV. And I want to see if they have any different uh, DVDs in here. So um, I was going to do a separate video for the RV shopping trip at Dollar Tree, but I only need a few things right now. So you guys come with me and we'll just tie it all into one. I filmed this one night when I was out here filming retail stuff at night. And I don't recall that it was a Dollar Tree then. I'm going to have to look back at that video. Definitely need to get a cart. Basket would actually be sufficient, I think, but... Okay, this is the first thing I need, guys. People are using these on their Blackstone grill, because you see that little sliver there? They're hanging them on the side like this to block the wind from coming in and blowing out their flames. So I need to get a handful of these. There's probably something else that would be a little bit more practical than these, because I have to get six of these. Not that that's any big deal, but you know, I have to watch what all I take into the RV because there's only so much space. Now I do have two of these already to use for different oils for the grill, but I think I will get another pack because it's only a dollar for two of them. And there's a couple of different kinds of oils that I use. Okay, and this is something else that I saw online that somebody had. It's an egg tray that is perfect. Um, this is the lid Goes right on there, and that's an egg tray for the fridge And here's our splatter screens. I definitely need to get at least one if not two of these just wonder I think this will be better only because without the uh, Without the handle I like the handles, but without the handles it takes up less space. Oh Yes, here we go butter dish definitely got to have one of those I think a tablecloth. I better get one of these. That's probably something that later on I'll actually come in here and buy about 50 of them <laughs> just to keep them on hand in the RV because that's something I'm going to be getting all the time when I go to these campgrounds, you know, to put over my uh, my picnic table. Okay, let's get... Ooh, this is a two-pack. Cool. Always find joy in the journey. That fits. We'll get those and an oven mitt because I'm no doubt going to need this at some point. Here we go. I need a couple pairs of these gloves for whenever I dump tanks. I'd be willing to bet that I can order a ton of these gloves online in bulk for very little money. So I'm going to have to look that up too, but that'll serve the purpose for now. Look at this. I love these deep bowls. Like, if you're going to have cereal, you got to be able to have half the box in one sitting. <laughs> Look at this. I ignored this over there, but this is actually a really good deal. This is parchment, pa parchment paper squares that you put between your hamburgers when you're making them. Like, and then you take them out to the grill. There's a hundred sheets in there. I am totally going to get that. Oh my gosh, look at this, guys. They have Dolly Madison Zingers. These are so delicious. I haven't had these for the longest time. Oh, I should never go in these stores hungry. I also cannot walk past Coast without taking a big whiff. So good. Okay, here they have some drawer organizers. But I kind of have to measure my drawers first. <laughs> this is cool. They've got all kinds of different little organizational things here. These little boxes. These could go in the overhead compartments and stuff. That's definitely something I'll need to be getting later on, but again, I just have to measure for everything, and I have to kind of go through and look and organize in my mind before I really start buying any of that stuff. 
I think that's all I want to get for the RV right now, but that's good because I just found our DVDs right here. Alright, most of these we can read on the spine, so we're going to be able to see if there's things we haven't seen before. Boone, the bounty hunter. I know what that is. Toopy and Bingo treasure hunt. Oh lord, Assassin's Creed. A little game. Ralph Macchio is in this. Ooh, Olympia Dukakis. Me likey. <laughs> Brawler. Never heard of this one. Please be good. Journey to Space. I think we saw that one. Documentary type kind of thing. Venus and Serena. Hmm. Let's see here. Come on, give us some good stuff. Edwin Boyd. I don't even know what that is. I haven't seen that anywhere else, though. Midnight Man. Haven't seen that one either, but doesn't look like anything good. The Thompsons. Twilight meets Tarantino. No thanks. Pretty bad actress. Okay, it's probably a pretty bad movie. Headshot. Uh, nobody in that that I know. What's this? The Almighty Johnsons. Um, okay. No. Wait, what's this? Red Hook Summer. That's a Spike Lee joint. I've never heard of that one. The Extra Man. Hmm, that looks like Kevin. Yeah, Kevin Klein. Okay. Let's see anything else? Something good, please. Come on. No, nope, everything is just the same. Adventures of a Teenage Dragon Slayer. That might be kind of fun, but no. I do need some kind of clamps to hold the uh, tablecloth on the table if I'm outside at a picnic table, or else it's going to be blown away, but those are way too small. Oh, sweet, guys. Look, we got a ton more DVDs here. Yes! All right, I'm already seeing some that I have not seen anywhere else. A bunch. Look at this. We got the Terminator. Yes. Holy crap. Okay, I'm getting excited. Resident Evil. I, I don't really care for that one, though. Um, let's see. Look at this. Snoopy Come Home and A Boy Named Charlie Brown. That My kids used to watch uh, Snoopy Come Home all the time when they were little. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Hunt, my boy Jack, blah, blah, blah. Let's just keep on looking through. In Darkness. Uh, let's see here. The Smurf. Secret Life of Cats and Dogs. That would be a cool one, you know, for the kids. Here's that run all night. Um, Liam Neeson is in this one. I bet this is a good movie, but I'm just, I'm not going to get it. Let's see. All right, here we go. Stephen King. Lang oh, that's loose in there. The Lang Langoliers, or however you say it. All right, let's see here. I don't know what that is. Aim high. Frank and Lola. Michael Shannon is in that. Hmm. I don't know what that is. I'm going to look at that in a minute here. What is this? The stream. Join the dork side. What the heck? Rain Wilson, Mario Lopez. What in the heck is this? I gotta look at that. All right, let's see. Sacrifice, Rock Away, Frank. I've never heard of that one. The Road, 2307. I don't know what that one is either. Okay, Yellow Day. Here's that stream thing again. Uh, you don't know, Bo. <laughs> Breaking a monster? The heck is that? I don't know what that one is either. Um, let's see. What is this? Rendell, Dark Vengeance. I don't know what that is. It looks kind of cool, but. Alright, let's see here. Nerdland? What is that? Paul Rudd is in this. Okay, I'm definitely getting it. It, it looks like it's all animated, but Paul Rudd is in it, so I think I'm probably going to get that. Paradise. 
Dance Academy Ice Age Giants. Wait. Hmm, okay. Starbuck. The Recall. I don't know what that is. Wesley Snipes is in both of these. Hey, look. Bad Boys. I don't really like that movie, but it's kind of cool to see it here. Jack and the Cuckoo Clock Heart. Hmm. Look at this. Look at this. The Lego Movie on Blu-ray. Yes. Sweet. I'm finding some awesome one here. The Young Messiah. Um, I passed on that the other day. Let's see what else we got here. Uh... On, give me something else good. An American wrestler. What the heck? I don't know what that is. All right, let's see. Uh, oh, that's the Wiggles. Memory Hackers. The Smurfs Season 1, Volume 1. 19 cartoons. Oh my gosh, guys, I grew up on the Smurfs. I'm buying it. <laughs> Here we go. Twilight Eclipse on Blu ray. I mean, that's not for me, but it's pretty amazing to see it here on Blu-ray. Uh, let's see, Alice in Wonderland. That's a different version. There's so many versions of Alice in Wonderland. Jack the Giant Slayer, we got that the other day. The Nativity. Uh, right, let's keep on moving here. Jack and Jill. Somebody told me that was a hilarious movie. I think I'll watch it on my fire stick, though. Let's see, here's Rise of the Empire. Oh, that's 3D, too. Yep, I'm going to get that one. Ninja Assassin. Nah. Scorpion King. Let's see. American Pastime. Uh, Predestination. Here's the Terminator again. I wish it was Blu-ray. I hope I find one on Blu-ray. That would be so cool. Uh, Damascus cover? I don't know what that is. Resident Evil, Trapped in Time, Spider-Man 3. Holy crap. I really love this movie. But I'm not going to get it. Oh, we got a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I could be wrong, but I think this is an animated version, so I'm not going to get it. Look, guys, we have R.L. Stein's Haunting Hour. Oh, I love this kind of stuff. I'm not going to get it, but I absolutely love it. Let's see, Stargate Atlantis. Passion Play, I don't know what that is. Oh, crap, I think that's it. The rest are just uh, books, but look at this. Man, we got a good stack of them here. 300 Rise of an Empire in 3D. The Smurfs Season 1. What's this one? The Lego Movie. That's I'm surprised about that one. Jack and the Cuckoo Clock Heart. I'm really tempted to get that. Um, it looks like something that would be like The Corpse Bride or something. I think I'll just watch that one on the fire stick. Um, Nerdland. I'm really tempted because I love Paul Rudd. But I think I'll just pass on that one, too. And the Terminator, I was trying to think. It's not loose in there, so that's good. I was trying to think if I have this already. I know I have T2. But I don't think I have Part 1, so I'm going to get it. It's only a buck. If I have it, I just have a double, and I'll give it to somebody else. All right, I'm ready to jam here. I'm glad I didn't just, like, turn around and leave after I saw those other DVDs. We found the good ones. All right, guys, that was sweet. I got both bags full of all this stuff, three DVDs and everything for a total of 21 bucks and some change, and that included tax. That is awesome. That's like the price of one DVD. <laughs> so, all right, guys, that was a pretty good shopping trip. Stick around. We'll do some more. You guys seem to be liking these.